bro, this kind of just feels like an episode of Euphoria, to be honest. All right, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be watching super bad now another seth rogan movie with jonah hill and michael Sarah in it and this is actually mclovin i know i've talked about mclovin a good amount of times on this channel but i have not seen super bad then how do i know who mclovin is well because i've seen the memes i i was aware of the character growing up how everyone talked about him however everyone referenced him and stuff i even had one of his fake ids I used to carry that around as like a joke or whatever. I don't think I have it anymore though. Like I don't, I have no idea where it went, but McLovin's like the only thing I really know about Superbad to be honest. So that's like the only spoiler really, but, but I'm really curious to know the context behind it. So, so I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're just gonna hop right into this movie. If you'd like to watch the full length reaction, that'd be available on Patreon as well as early access to the next two movies that I do will also be available on Patreon and YouTube membership. Click the join button down below. There will be a link down in the description to a playlist of all the early access videos I have available. So check that out. But anyways, let's get started. I'm just sick of all the amateur stuff, you know? I mean, like, if I'm paying top dollar, I want a little production value, you know? Like some editing, transition, something, some music. Yeah, you know... <laughs> porn? Yeah, but they don't really show dick going in, which is a huge concern. I didn't realize that. Plus, have you ever seen a vagina by itself? No, no problem, Jane. How are you? No, miss each other? No, thank you. I know I don't miss each other. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna cry myself to sleep every night. Me too. When I'm out. No, they're definitely gonna miss each other. I am truly jealous you got to suck on those tits when you were a baby. Jesus Christ. At least you got to suck on your dad's dick. <laughs> what? This movie's fucking wild already. <laughs> what are we, four minutes into this? I almost blew a load into my belly button. <laughs> ever, have you ever stared into his eyes? It was like the first time I heard the Beatles. <laughs> Why would she end her high school career with me? You know, Becca dated Eric Rosecrans for like two years. You're actually a step up from that dick load. That's why you need to stop being a... Will you get this for me? That's why you need to stop... <laughs> we all have that one, friend. Evan! Hey. Uh, thank you for your pen. Do you hear about Jesse's grad party next weekend? <laughs> yeah. I, uh, it's a maybe. Really? For me, because of all the other fun shit I'm off doing. <laughs> I'd love to be at all of them, but I couldn't find a minute to make do? an appearance over there. Um, Saturday was actually a crazy <laughs> night for me. You can't give a real answer. What the fuck? You can't give a straight answer. He's just saying crazy shit. Sounds like a lot of fun. You know, I, I'd love to go do something like that sometime. Thank you for the pen. Yeah, no problem. Oh. Bye. <laughs> he does a good job of being like a really awkward kid. I wash and dry. I'm like a single mother. Look, we all know home ec is a joke. No offense. It's just like everyone takes his class that I don't ever need to cook tiramisu. When am I gonna need to cook tiramisu? Am I gonna be a chef? No, there's three weeks left in school. Give me a fucking break. Either pair up with her station four. Jules. Oh shit, it's Emma Watson. Jesus Christ. No, it's Emma Stone, it's Emma Stone. Do me. Bro is so fucking horny. I don't know, my parents are out of town, so I was thinking about having like a party. Jules is having a fucking party. Don't tell Fogo about the party. Gangsters, mm. what's up guys? I was just walk. <laughs> uh, it's 10.33. <laughs> what? I told her what time it was. This is cool as fuck. Cool shit. <laughs> At lunch, I'm going to the same place Mike Snyder went to pick up my brand new fake ID. Mm-hmm. I was just like, I heard about this party and we shouldn't tell Fogel about it. And I was like, no, you should totally tell Fogel. And that way you could buy his booze now. It's awesome. Sure, we'll buy the booze. Yeah, man, we're going to get our drinks on and we're going to party. And get Bro, I don't care what his ID says. I would never believe he's 21. Even if he, like, legitimately was 21 with a real ID, I would, no, I would still not believe it. I mean, we're not dependent on each other. You know? I mean, it's like we met when we were eight. You know, we were fine before then. <laughs> Give my middle nut to start dating Becca. Becca's a bitch. <laughs> Seriously getting fucking sick of you talking about her like that. Why do you hate her so much? You've never given me a reason. I'm starting to just think that you like her. Fuck no, man. I hate Becca. Why, man? When I was a little kid, I kind of had this problem. And it's not even that big of a deal. Sit around all day and draw pictures of dicks. <laughs> dicks? Dude, I'm going to be honest. When I was in school and I was bored as shit, Sometimes I'd be doing that. 
I'd just sit there for hours on end drawing dicks. I don't know what it was. I couldn't touch the pen to a piece of paper without it drawing the shape of a penis. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny. I remember being in English class in eighth grade. But my friend was sitting across the class from my guy's attention. And <laughs> on a piece of paper, I drew a dick on it. And I showed him across the room or whatever. And then he drew him back. But he drew, he drew his even bigger than mine. So I drew a bigger one on the paper and I showed him that. And we went back and forth until the fucking teacher caught us. She's like, what the fuck are you doing? All of a sudden. Pussy. You hit Becca's foot with your dick? <laughs> no. The, the, the drawing. This is probably the veiniest dick ever. <laughs> and she rats me out to the principal. He finds his Ghostbusters lunchbox dick treasure <laughs> All of them. Okay, I was I wasn't like this. I wasn't getting creative with it and shit. <laughs> he calls him my parents. Oh, it's that fucking guy is a principal. And he thinks I'm possessed by some sort of dick devil. <laughs> Cause it's like fully on. Yeah, why? Should I not come? Cause I could think of other shit. Oh, no, or... no, I, I want you to come. I just, um, you said something earlier about like a fake ID or something, right? Um, I mean, she invited, she invited him before she did that. Can you get us booze? Yeah. I'll see you tonight. Evan, get into the game. Take it over to me. <laughs> Bro, I played soccer and that was literally me. When I was like fucking nine. Jules and her stupid fucking friend came up to me and they asked me to buy her alcohol. Bro, he ran on the soccer field to tell them this? Tell me enough to decide that I was the guy she would trust with the whole funness of her party. Mm. She wants to fuck me. She wants my dick in or around her mouth. No, bro. Maybe she's just using you to get her alcohol? Yes. I was just about to say that. She's DTF. She's down to fuck, man. Mm. Be in Vegie. She wants to fuck, man. <laughs> I make her my girlfriend, and I've got like two solid months of sex. By the time college rolls around, I'll be like the Iron Chef of Pounding Vage. Fuck, Evan, we're down two points. <gasps> That's James Ringo. Fuck you, man. Oh my god, dude, he's young. That was like eight years ago, asshole. People don't forget. <laughs> Sounds the exact same, though. You can tell it's him from the eyebrows, too. Wait, did I say James Ringo? No, that's Dave. That's Dave. I meant to say Dave. That's Dave. Fuck. Tonight, I shouldn't have fucked that guy. We could be that mistake. That's horrible. You talk to Becca, I'll talk to that retard Fogel. Don't worry. Bro, Seth is such a fucking degenerate. Yo, guys. Seth. Let me see it. You pussy out or what? No, no, man. I got it. It's... Oh, let's see this. Hawaii. <laughs> Alright, that's, that's good. Hard to try. <laughs> Change your name to McLovin? <laughs> McLovin? Oh, they let you pick any name you want when you get down there. <laughs> and you landed on McLovin. <laughs> yeah. That was between that and Muhammad. Why the fuck would it be between that and Muhammad? Why don't you pick a common name like a normal person? <laughs> Muhammad is the most commonly used name on earth. We had a fucking book for once. Fogel, have you ever... <laughs> have you actually ever met anyone named McLovin? No. No, that's why you picked a dumb fucking name. <laughs> fuck you. You look like a future pedophile in this picture, number one. Number two, it doesn't even have a first name. It just says McLovin. Bro. ID says you're 25 years old. Why wouldn't you just put 21, man? Every day, hundreds of kids go into the liquor store with their fake IDs, and every single one says they're 21. Mm, but not 25. You do, you're nowhere close to 25, bro. Bro, I'm actually 23. Whenever I try to buy any alcohol, I'm carded 100% of the time. No one's McLovin. McLovin's never existed because that's a made up, dumb, fucking fairy tale name, you fuck! <laughs> He's so mad. No, I can't do that. I can't let Jewel see me when I wore to school. It's completely unbecoming. No one's gotten a hand job in cargo shorts since Nam. What the fuck on that? St it's still like a weird outfit. It's still kind of off. Okay, what the fuck are you wearing? I look older. You look like Pinocchio. No, you really fucked me on this one. Bro, he's so rude to McLovin, bro. You still haven't told him that we're rooming together? Hmm. And take off your vest. You look like Aladdin. <laughs> he knows it's gonna crush Seth's feelings if he knows they're moving in together. What's up, Paul Blart? Oh, piggy can run. Bro, you're, he's not getting away with this ball run. This is gonna go so bad. How old are you? 22. You certainly are. That'll be $80. Oh, okay. Oh, this is in his head, this is in his head. Yeah, he's gonna pussy out. Don't do it, kid. 
never had a choice. <laughs> Bro, what? Why would you throw it at him? Why would he throw it back? This is this is a lot of stuff, man. I don't, I don't know if I can get away with all this. What difference does it make how much it is? I don't know, man. I'm like really nervous. Wait, what if what if I go in there and they turn me down, man? Well, then you leave. You go to a different place. What if they make me put the liquor back on the shelf? I can't do that. Bro, they're not gonna make you do that. They'll restock it themselves. It's funny because when you like, I remember being this young. Shit like this was such a big deal. Like just getting like getting rejected in a store or whatever that would have been such a big deal to me but like no it's like it doesn't matter now <laughs> it's funny it's like that was so many things like he's nervous because he doesn't want to get kicked out and humiliated in front of everyone but it's like it literally doesn't matter just be like okay and then leave but he can't do it that's always <gasps> oh my god that's all he's gonna get yeah, because he's so nervous dude <laughs> why would you drop that <laughs> he's so nervous so did you do this on the floor nope no <laughs> And you should really clean this up. Someone could really hurt themselves. It's fucked up. Fuck my life. Yeah, I'd be so fucking pissed. <laughs> hey, so did you bring a condom for tonight? You brought a condom with you? What? I had, like, a general outline. You know, I was going to go down on her for, like, several hours, okay? Bro. <laughs> Before I dry hump the shit out of her leg. <laughs> what makes you think that is realistic? <laughs> for hours? Bro, she knows. She knows. I love that stuff. Been drinking it for years. Okay. I'm gonna need to see some identification. Makes me feel young again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Your total is hmm? 96.59. Uh. <gasps> oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. Someone's robbing the store. What is this? What's that? Oh, wait. Now they're gonna think that McLovin's busted, though. Holy shit, they busted Fogel. Yeah. He assaulted the customer, grabbed the cash, and ran out. So... Wow. <laughs> Fucking Bill later and said they're looking at the cops. Start here. Just tell me when. I'll start in the bottom. No, no, don't do, don't do the opposite. Like, <laughs> kind of look like Eminem. Does oh, that help you? No, not in Eminem. Do you look like this? <laughs> I'm an amateur. That looks like a Muppet. <laughs> and then he jumps over you. He feels you up, violates you. I did not say that. No, he doesn't. Look. Jesus Christ. Well, are they gonna like take him downtown or something? Fuck Fogel! Bro, gotta... you're a shitty friend to him, dude. He... Fuck Fogel! We need a new way to get liquor, which is- Your mindset about what's happening Fuck to him is Sinky, fucked we up. Need to act. Shit. <gasps> oh. uh, I am so sorry, man. See you at all, man. Are you okay? Please don't report me, man. We can figure this out, right? We can... Because I'll do anything. Mm. Like literally? Fucking anything. Buy us booze. You better get us a shitload of cash or a shitload of alcohol or you're going to fucking prison. Seven bucks? Bro. Are you fucking serious? This isn't enough. Bro, you look like you're 30. You should have a fucking credit card or a debit card. Like, just. Ah, oh, my back! No, 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 no. My wait, back, wait, cops! Wait, my wait, back! Wait, wait, wait. I'm going to this party right now, bro. Hmm. Okay? It's got booze. It's got girls. So you want to go steal alcohol from this other party? All right. He's too old to be going to Jules' party. There's no way. Well, I hope your friends are ready to get fucked up. I'm sure they will be. Bro, this dude's a weirdo. <laughs> He's trying too hard to be cool with them. Who's gonna give it to her, huh, my man? You. That's him. Yeah, see, he's trying too hard, dude. But uh, he's just trying to be a bro. You guys in my space? No, but he's, he's just trying to be a bro because he fucking can't show the hell out of his car. <laughs> he doesn't want him to report him, so. Well, we need this liquor. No, you need it. I don't need it. I'm just gonna tell Becca how I feel, and then maybe she'll get with me, okay? I'm not gonna get her drunk out of her mind. How come you never made a move, you pussy? Because I respect her, Seth. I'm not gonna put that kind of unfair pressure on her, all right? I mean, come on, I just don't see a problem here. Let's just do it. We're leaving, okay? These guys could kill us. Michael Sarah's right. No, but I would get killed for pussy. No questions asked. Fuck Bro, this, man. You've never had pussy. That's why you think that. You were doing it once. Ah! Oh, God! Get the fuck out of my way! <laughs> Should I shoot him? No. <laughs> Ooh, he smacked his head. <laughs> like, actually scared him. I feel like that wasn't acting. It's just legitimately scared Michael Sierra. <laughs> Evan, can you hear me? Hello? Anything? I'm a piece of shit. Ooh, ooh. Piece of shit fucking phone. <laughs> Becca. It's Becca. Mm. Did you just Some of a fucking bitch. Phone company. That's... Goddamn flip phone. That'd be so fucking hard. What? Becca. 
bro, why would you say that? All that out of frustration. That's what makes no sense. Like, like if you're really that frustrated, sure, say that stuff quietly to yourself. Don't say that over the phone with Becca. <laughs> like, even if there wasn't static interrupting him, so it's not like he said all that. Just in general, you shouldn't say that. What are you talking about, man? Dude, is that blood? Ooh. I'm not cut or anything. Why would I be bleeding? Are you dancing with some chick in there? Ah, uh, so. It's blood, dude. That's uh damn i see i see but why would i be bleeding why the fuck would i be dude why would there be blood because uh, he's gonna realize oh, yeah fuck. he's realized oh, someone peering on my fucking leg oh, shit. i'm gonna go get bill he's gotta check this shit oh, out fuck. So, what did you fuck oh, up shit. bill yeah. bill has nothing to do with this <laughs> bill has nothing to do with this <laughs> Well, he ate that punch. Because you can take a hit like a champ, man. Seriously, take that. Uh, are there any ladies we'd like to show this tape to? The... <laughs> Just the way he said that, dude. The way he's acting is is really good. He's really solid in it. You know what? I bet I know your trick, McLovin. You play the whole mystery. Calling all units. Armed and dangerous off. man in the vicinity. Be back up! There's so much blood. I bet you play the. Bro, they're just gonna ignore that. All right, uh, it looks like we got a call. Oh, yeah. We can't pay for these. Yeah, bro, we'll be right there. Bro, it's good. Face about to pull up on him right here. <laughs> oh, he just hit the mother load. Oh my god. Bro, you can only carry like what, like seven or like eight of those max. Who's that guy? Hi. Who is that guy? Who's this guy? Hey, fellas. Who's this guy? I was just using the phone. I'm gonna leave. He, he's Jimmy's brother, the guy, the singer. You he's know. the guy with the beautiful voice I was what telling you about. Oh, they're gonna make him sing, huh? Hey, oh my God! Sing Damn. for us. Sing. Oh, it's not me. to be here tonight, and you're not gonna sing for him. Fucking bullshit. Sing. sing. You're a fucking sing. Bro, that guy looks like he looks like Jason from David Dobrik's vlogs, just like a way younger version. What's it like to have guns? <laughs> it is. Awesome. Can I hold one of your guns? Yeah, sure. Come with me. <laughs> Why not? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, have a blast. Wow, I'm surprised he unloaded it first. Oh, you gotta stay in too. We're blood brothers. Shut the fuck up. You're in my house. You answer my questions. What are you doing with dancing with Jacinda? We didn't get off dancing with my fiance. Bro, she came on to me. <laughs> oh, no, they're making him sing. Crying. These eyes have seen a lot of love, but they're never gonna see another one like <laughs> He's really singing his heart out. Does Joni even have the beers on him? Oh, he poured it on the fucking thing. That's what he did. Oh, that's disgusting. Even though you dumped it out, you still, like, I think he understands there's still some oil in it. I just got mixed with all that alcohol, with all that beer. How the fuck am I supposed to get into Dartmouth? You knew I couldn't get into Dartmouth. How fucking selfish are you? You had no problem letting Fogel take the fall back there. You obviously don't want yeah. me going to a good school. Fuck, man. So what the fuck do you want? I'm not going to let you slow me down anymore, Seth. What are you saying? We're I've done. wasted the last three years of my life sitting around talking bullshit with you, man. And fuck you. And next time you're pissed off about something, don't keep it inside for 10 years. Say it like a fucking man. Don't touch me. Fuck you. <laughs> All right, come on, stop it. Wait. Hey, hey, stop. Stop. Fuck you, Evan. Oh, yeah, it again. It was by the fucking car. It was by the car. I was just like this time. Is everyone okay? Yeah, we're great. Thanks. It's funny because they have no idea Fogo's in that car, and Fogo has no idea they're outside of the car. The boys doing a bit of drinking tonight? No, officer. Not at all. No, we... I don't believe you. Bro, you really just hit him with the car, and now you're going to bust him for having beer? Well, I don't want to get shit canned. I happen to like this job. I like this job too. I get free here because okay. I'm not taking the phone. Okay. Can. Okay. Them shits. Okay. We're, we're gonna pin it on them. Spin your shit. What? Get on the ground. I am the law. Okay. Now hold hands. Oh, he's running. Oh shit! <laughs> the way, dude. The way he ran away. <laughs> Bro, why is he running like that? Because like actually butt hurt him. You're gonna tell her how you feel. Okay, well good luck getting Jules drunk enough to have sex with you. What's wrong with you guys? Nothing. 
You two femmes can talk about it next year at a little slumber party. Oh, you told him. No. Told me what? Yeah. An idiot, Fogel. Mm. We gotta tell him now. No, we... No. Well, he knows something's up. Fogel. What the? What are you guys talking? Seth, me and Evan are rooming together next year at college. What's the big deal? I didn't tell you because I, I thought... Because you're a backstabber and you lied... No, because I knew you'd get hella butthurt about it. Didn't expect this from you, Evan. Not from you. <laughs> he feels like the fucking man now. Like... <gasps> Oh wait, it's that fucking kid from um Kick Ass in Sex Drive, bro. I rec yeah, that's definitely him. That's definitely him. All night. Really? What did she say? Was she 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 told you that she thinks I'm a good guy? <laughs> I will fully blow him tonight. Mm. What? He's gonna turn her down though, cause he doesn't want he doesn't want her to do it if she's gonna be hammered, cause he's a good fucking guy. But she's totally so, hammered, and if yeah. I get with her and I'm not drunk, isn't that like unethical? Mm -hmm. Oh, not if you're drunk too. I guess so. He's not doing it. No, oh, he's, he's gonna try and get hella drunk right here though. But it's not gonna work. He's not gonna be able to do it. Down the hatch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that easy just to down alcohol like that. Vogel. Stuff. Um, oh, she likes confidence. That's disgusting. But it was delicious. Oh, oh, no, she, no, she does not. No, 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 no. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's wrong? We just do that at um, at some other time. No, there's no other time. School's up. What's wrong with right now? Not uh, right now. You know, not while you're drunk. But, you know, thank you. <laughs> bro, I, bro, your dick's not even gonna work being as drunk as you are. I'm so wet. Oh, yeah. She I doesn't said know that would happen that. in hell. <laughs> <laughs> really pretty, and I just think this isn't how I pictured it. I don't understand why you have to be such a little bitch about it. I'm scared. See, I, like, I think we're not thinking clearly. <laughs> oh, holy shit. Oh, my God. Go get Gabby. <laughs> I'll go get her. He did the right thing. Damn, Vogel's fucking getting it, dude. What a fucking plot twist. <laughs> I got a boner. <laughs> <laughs> this is my last chance, and I fucked it up. Your last chance to do what? To make you my girlfriend for the summer. Bro. You Honey, that was never gonna happen. No matter what. What does me being drunk have anything to do with it? Yeah, with me if you were sober. Look at me. Come on, you didn't blow it. I think maybe. Oh. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, now he blew it. Now he blew it for sure. Oh, <gasps> the cops are here. It's them. Come on, we will shoot you. Party's Bro, we will shoot you. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, they do. The Phil Hader's fucking hilarious. Oh god, is it in? Oh god. It's in. Oh god. god it's in. Alright, everybody out. Uh, come on, let's oh, go. Shit. Oh shit. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Get away from me! Contain yourself! We're friends! Shut up! Come Why? Come you just cock blocked McLovin. Dude, that we should be guiding his cock. Not the bar. <laughs> Yeah, bro, he's stuck in it for fucking a quarter of a second max. <laughs> he needs his inhaler already. I thought, that, okay, I totally thought it was about to be a thing where he's like, fucking, and then he nuts, and then she's like, did you, and then she was going to be like, is it in yet? When he's already nutted before you even put it in. Dude, Mc, no, McLovin's definitely the type of dude to nut as he puts the condom on, too. Look, we've all been one pump chomps, but not when putting the condom on, but <laughs> like. That's only McLovin. I just wish we could make it up to you somehow later. Do you think you can do me a really big favor? What is mm -hmm. it? Anything. You're crazy! Stay back for your own safety! Get off me, fucking cops! Oh, make it look like he's getting arrested. Like he's. A... I'm Fogel! Uh, <laughs> Did get hold of me? Holy Fine. shit, Fogel's fucking... a badass. Yeah, give him fucking street cred. Get hold of me! <laughs> fucking pigs! <laughs> oh! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh! Yeah. oh. oh. Honestly, yeah, fuck that guy. Nice mullet, asshole. <laughs> nice mullet. Well, we caught the infamous Vogel. 
Angle away from me on the outside. Man, that's gonna get you so much ass. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, that was pretty smart, I guess. It's funny. You saved me? Mm hmm. Because we're still bros at the end of the day. Sleep over at my house? You want to come sleep? Okay. Bro, this kind of just feels like an episode of Euphoria, to be honest. Make the badge proud, Slater. That's some crash, hella hard. <laughs> Okay, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. Oh, he's he's not dead. He's fucking crazy. Let's do this. All right. Hurry, 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 hurry. Light on fire. Oh. <laughs> oh, they're totally gonna get fucking fired. <laughs> Break yourself, fool. And I saw your housing. Like forms. Oh, uh, he already knew, huh? So I knew you and Fogel were gonna live together. I should have told you. But I don't know why I didn't. Yeah, I mean, it's not really that big of a deal. I mean, he just feels left out, I guess. I'm afraid to live with strangers. Valid. I love you. I'm not even embarrassed to say it. I just. I, I love you. A new comforter for college. Cool, so, uh. Your mom's got huge tits. <laughs> what? I feel bad that I'm making you buy me a new one. It seems like ridiculous. No. Damn, man, she, she has a black eye from him. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. God damn, they're fucking fates, dude. <laughs> Bro, they should be arrested for those fates. And I'm gonna get Jules a new comforter. Oh, mm. I have to get a comforter oh. too for college. Figured I would need one. Yeah. So set. Oh, uh, they split up. So do you wanna come buy me cover up or something? I mean, you kind of owe me. Yeah, definitely. I would love to do that. Give you a lift, and then Evan could take Becca home. I don't know if it's in your route. Be fine with me. Route. So I guess I'll call you. Yeah. Give me a call. Yeah, you have my number. I have your information. Still? So. Uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Besties, bro. Besties. They're not used to being away from each other. Just like they said in the beginning. They've been friends since they've been best friends since they were both eight years old. Guess you gotta grow up at some point. Alright! Holy shit, that was super bad. Alright, well that was super bad. Holy shit. Okay, this movie was absolutely hilarious. A lot of cussing in this movie. Well, I watched the unrated version too, so that's probably why. A lot of F-words are said in this damn movie, so this might not get cleared on YouTube, but I, I think it's fine. All right, you know what movie this makes me want to watch now? A movie I haven't seen too is Project X. I'm pretty sure that movie came out when I was a bit older, when I was actually allowed to watch those kinds of movies. Oh yeah, it came out in 2012. But I didn't have any friends to like watch it with, so I never did. Yeah, I don't I don't want to watch it alone, so I didn't. But but we could definitely do it now for the channel. So let me know if I should. I have like a pretty brief idea what this movie is about. You know, it's about this fat, fat party, and it all just like kind of goes wrong or something like that. But anyway, the comedy in this movie was pretty good. It was pretty brutal though, dude. I think some of the funniest parts in the movie are is just how awkward all three of them are. Like, it, like they did a really good job of acting the scenes too. Like, totally works for this movie. It works very well for this movie and their characters. <laughs> like, they just don't know how to talk to anyone that's not their friend. The ending to this movie felt really wholesome. Like, it's okay that you guys don't need to spend every single second with each other. You guys can have other friends too and actually talk to girls and actually hang out with girls the way you're supposed to not just meet them at parties and fuck and actually build a relationship with them you know like seth's plan was never gonna work even if they did fuck she was never gonna date him because it's like they, they haven't established a relationship prior or whatever so like kind of like not really like you know not like not not dating wise you know so they don't know enough about each other to date so but yeah that was super bad one of the funniest movies i've seen in a very long time comment down below what you thought about this movie down below in the comments and if you liked the video like the video and thanks for watching